how did the MPH class help me? One, it helped me to be able to talk <coughs> in front of both a friendly and an unfriendly environment. <laughs> Two, it gave us tools and uh, basically an approach to analyze a public health situation. So it is the adaptability of the approach that I found particularly useful. Being able to operate successfully in cross-cultural teams. Uh, that, while it looks like it may not be academic, but the fact that you get to understand other cultures' temperaments and uh, be able to understand, for example, that uh, some people are a little more, let me say, they're a little more inclined to communicate everything they think. <laughs> Others may be a little more conservative. Do so to be able... Uh, I will not discuss it. <laughs> <laughs> but you see, it's, it's the idea that you are able to manage a multicultural team. And in international public health programming, it is inevitable. You will work with people who are different from you. And sometimes the deliverables actually depend on you maintaining good relationships. Even though I was a supervisor to the Sentinel sites, which are sites that are responsible for drug therapeutic efficacy trials and malaria surveillance, I really wasn't, I didn't know what it was all about because I didn't have the skills and the experience and I really wasn't able to do the job I was expected to do well. My experience here has really, really helped me and has put me on a better pedestal to be able to, you know, think more critically, to look at things more critically, and also it also helps to boost my confidence in working with partners and in working with my colleagues. The first thing is that I've become very comfortable in planning issues and setting priorities. I am no longer scared of the big, the big names in World Health Organization because we are talking the same language, you know? <laughs> it's, uh, I can set priorities, we can design programs, and uh, my thinking has broadened. It's been a very wonderful experience, one of the best times of my life. Having listened to everybody, you would understand that people have been well-schooled, and not only have they gained immense knowledge, they have been able to apply those knowledge. So it's a really great program, and I thank all the donors, the sponsors, for sending us here and bringing us back here again to share our experiences. It's, it's good to be back. Thank you very much. The program has been running since 1970, and today we have over 700 graduates in 95 countries. Our alumni, as well as our current student body, are made up of primarily physicians, but also nurses, health economists, policy people, as well as lawyers and other people in fields and disciplines not directly related to public health, but who have an interest in moving the public health field forward. The program was international, having students from different countries, multidisciplinary, it was really wonderful because then you get the added experience of uh, getting experience from people from other countries and then there is this wonderful network of uh, students who had been on the program, students who had been funded by the Pears Foundation, students who had studied in the Hebrew University and then the faculty, so you have this wonderful network that you can always fall back to. And use. I believe, and I think my friends will concur, that Israel has a reputation for excellence in the area of medicine. So it wasn't really a gamble. The International Masters of Public Health program was um, an experience on several levels. First of all, academically, it was very challenging, very intense. We had wonderful faculty staff right from the director to the ones handling particular core subjects. I think that with our graduates, we were able to make a difference because our graduates, after receiving interdisciplinary education in all aspects of public health, were able to go back to their respective countries and to take up key positions as either teachers or lecturers in different universities or uh, as, um, I would say, leading public health figures in different uh, arenas. To see the impact that the International MPH program has had on what are clearly an outstanding group of African alumni is uh, impressive. 
it uh, brings home the responsibility these promising younger professionals carry, but also the importance of the skills and the competencies they gain, and by implication just how wonderful and how valuable this uh, booster course, this refresher program, which the Peers Foundation have uh, generously supported. I'm so glad that the Peers Foundation actually came in supporting the international MPH program of the Hebrew University and therefore made it possible for someone like myself to be able to attain such an excellent training. Um, we, we are thankful for the Peers Foundation for doing that.